can see. I'm just going to go inside on. So uh, we're going to grab the man in his tight clinch and we're going to have control of his wrist. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to be pulling him in and we're going to out. Coming back again, we're going to be pulling down on his head and also using his arm to get him underneath the blue shield underneath. What we don't want him is too far underneath, so we're going to go for the guillotine. Uh, not in here. So we're going to go back to his tricep with that hand and with this hand, we're going to fish underneath, just underneath his, just underneath his ear. We're going to rub the blade of his hands across between his cheekbone and his jaw and grab the other arm. And what we do when we do that is we rotate his head this way, which is not, not nice. So we pull his head in, we grab his tricep, we scrape to the blade, to his face. We're going to grab his arm, take a four and a half. What we're going to do there is just drop the hips, drop the hips into him and scrape. And then get the tap. What you can also do is when you're in that position, you just roll, roll, your, roll your arm. It just gives him a bit of extra pain. So roll it in, turn his head. Take a four your arm and it's going to drop the yep, <laughs> and drop the hips uh, towards his feet. Obviously, the squeezing. So, it's okay. We've got him pressed up, we've got him controlled. A good tight clinch as well. We've got, his, uh, got my elbow right in the middle of his chest so he can't shoot balls. And he'll keep the distance as well. Control his, uh, control his wrist and pull him in underneath. Stop his. Uh, Go back with his tricep and rub his hand across his face and lock his hand. Nice squeeze and drop his hips. Not, not nice at all. Um, I don't know if it'll be classed in the next fight as well, so if you're in the MMA fight, you might not be able to. It's classy, you're doing it in the face part, so you might get it. You're not getting it, okay? You're only going to go for the face part, effectively, it's called a face lock. Uh, so if you grab your partner, take you away. Oh, 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 oh. Cool, that would run nice. Try using your other arm as well, so try and switch it onto the other side because you're not always going to get the same grip. Try and do it the other way. Nice one, Andrew.